It's almost as though he watches the game of football from above while playing it at the same time. And that is staggering. I, I just feel that he, in his own eyes and his own vision, yeah. the game just slows down for him. Yeah. He plays in slow mode because it, it comes to him so easy and so naturally. And everyone's fast, <laughs> erratic when he comes yeah. into the box. But Messi just goes, right, the ball's come here, the goalkeeper's going to go that way. So I'll go that way. Puts it in and makes Courtois look silly, really, with a great finish. <laughs> I swear, if we had a camera on us in here, though, the way we were jumping up and down, I've lost my voice. We're screaming, and like, how is he doing this? He's like, he's embarrassing players, but with his head up. Yeah. You know, when people normally take his well and go through a cluster of players, their head's down, but they don't see the pitch. He's, he's taking people on and also seeing the pitch and where opponents are, spatial awareness, he's just phenomenal. <laughs> He belongs in the Vampire Hall of Fame because he always draws blood. This is what Einstein called a spooky action over distance. That's what he was on about. Amazing. There's no statistics for this, Phil. How can you do that? It's almost as though he's seeing himself from above when he plays, because yeah. he sees things that we couldn't see. We were going, what? And we were like, oh my God, what's he doing? Oh, what a pass. Um, he doesn't play selfishly. Um, these are other attributes that he has that, you know, he doesn't, doesn't play act. He doesn't dive. Um, he doesn't retaliate. And, and all around, he's, he's such a great example um, for football. And um, he sets uh, such a good example for young children to follow. That um, there's so much, there's so much to like about him. And of course, he plays for Barca. But when you see him put in that sort of show, it, look, I, it's cliche, but it's almost like a privilege, isn't it? Ooh. To be around, to uh, be able to watch that. Well, he looks at the game differently than the rest of us. You know, he sees things that that we don't see. I wouldn't even consider. One, if it's possible, and even attempting it. Yeah. I mean, his last goal is... How difficult is it? Oh dear. I mean, is there anybody else that's ever played the game could do that so well? I'm not, I'm not quite sure. How easy does it make it look? Yeah, yeah. That's, that's almost as frightening as... Not only is it a difficult skill to execute, but he makes it look as though he's played on the playground with a couple of his friends and hardly breaking a sweat. Shot was it? Right back at Messi! Again! Death touch for his third of the game! Cool out in a bomb disposal expert, Messi! The calculus of a goal finished in a nanosecond! And Poissevia, man! He can't believe it! Messi, the hat trick master, makes defenders wake up in slow motion after they've played against him. Messi arrives for number three. Sergio Roberto does wonderfully well in winning it and then running on. And again, that second ball delivered to Alan Yar for a potted goal. It's a cruel deflection of Simon Kier. And Messi again, a softer touch than the clap of the butterfly's wings. Brilliant, Leo. The, the greatest football player in, in, in the scope of what a footballer is that I have ever seen in my life.